All right, Ron, thank you. For teachers and students, this year has been very tough. Most of the year was spent online, but next year will be a different story. The Glendale School District is making sure their youngest students are ready for that when things get back to normal. So Ty is at William C. Jack School this morning. And Ty, it's one of those things where people talk about a lost year or how far these kids are, are behind. And I'm sure, you know, it's something educators have to think about. That's exactly right, but they are doing a great job kind of rolling with the punches, so to speak. So today is all about the soon to be kindergartners. They'll be coming through these lines here to get their informational packet. 14 different schools within the Glendale Elementary School District will be doing this today. So I've got Principal uh, Dennis here and Squeaks, the mascot <laughs> here out here this morning. Let's talk about this because obviously things look a little bit different this year. You guys have had to, we use this word all the time, we love it now, pivot. What would things look like if this were a normal school year? What would you guys be doing as far as this registration process? So in a normal school year, we would have a, a kindergarten registration event uh, families would get to come, they get to visit the classrooms, they would get to visit with the teachers, get all their information, um, and get to do a lot of those things, you know, in person in the classrooms. So you brought it to the curb? We did. We brought it to the curb, just like everything with this year. You know, we just had to adjust. Um, we're just uh, trying to continue doing all the great things we've done in the past, just in a different way. So this year we're making it a drive through event. So families get to come. We're still trying to bring some of the classroom out here. You know, we've got our mascot squeaky. We've got wonderful supplies for the kindergarten students. We still have information about our, our dual language program that we offer. Um, so we're just trying to bring it to the families out here at the curb rather than having them come to us in the classroom. You've made it very easy. We've got about a minute left. I want to talk about that dual language program because this is something you guys started just a while ago and parents and teachers and students really love this. Talk about that. Yeah, so we started it a few years back and we're building it every year. We add another grade level. Right now we have it kindergarten through second grade. It's a really great opportunity for kids. You know, they get to start in kindergarten learning two languages they get half the day in English half the day in Spanish um, and it's just the right time to really uh, get them to learn that language and um, it'll give them a lot of opportunities as they get older you know around the country especially in our state um, you know just knowing two languages is, sure. is better than knowing one opens and up a give lot lots of, doors. of job opportunities yeah. absolutely all right uh, squeaky uh, how excited are you can I get a um, a, a squeal get your, get your... <laughs> <laughs> there you go. And real quick, before we go, you guys, look at this. I saw this. This just made me feel so old. Welcome class of 2034. If I'm not bald soon, I will be bald by then. We've been doing a bald thing yeah. this morning, so definitely. Uh, well, thanks for everything that you guys are doing here. Good luck. Have fun today. I think the students are really going to enjoy this uh, new kind of way to get registered for uh, kindergarten here.